I'm reading Rutler's wonderful book, The Curé of Ars, a book on the, uh, on the life of St. John Vianney. St. John Vianney, the patron saint of priests. They say one of the greatest modern saints, a uh, humble priest from, from France, from the little vi village of Ars. And uh, St. John Vianney was a, a big inspiration in my own life, especially to become a priest. And as I read about St. John Vianney, it's becoming more obvious to me that his greatness, as with all the saints, his greatness doesn't lie in the great things he did, you know, battling with demons and his amazing fasting and um, the miracles and, and the, the ways he, he loved the people of God so wonderfully. His greatness lies in his poverty of spirit. That first beatitude, blessed are the poor in spirit, for theirs is the kingdom of God. St. John Vianney, the Curie of ours, was a humble man, a tremendously humble man who had the gift of tears. His whole life, he wept, his whole priesthood, he wept over his own sins, he wept over the sins of his parishioners, begged God for their conversion. A truly humble man, poor in spirit and blessed, a saint, a saint the likes of which the world rarely sees. And so let's, let's be inspired by St. John Vianney and all the saints who had this wonderful poverty of spirit. Poverty of spirit can kind of be described as being empty, being so empty that we can be filled with the utter fullness of God and we can, we can glorify God because of our, our wonderful disposition to God, our emptiness, our poverty, poverty of spirit. So St. John Vianney, Pray for us.